Um, so as far as my re last relationship goes, no, I don't still talk to him. Um, that was a question that was asked. No, um, you know, with everything that happened, I just, I could no longer agree with what he did or what he represented. And I just didn't feel the need to, um, reach out. Um, the last time that I did see him was about two and a half weeks ago when I was given my last paycheck. I was almost surprised that he gave it to me. It was for $440. I was cut off, you know, mid, mid pay, um, period. So it wasn't that much money. Um, he had complained uh, before firing me. Now I want to keep in mind, keep you guys in mind that I want you to keep in mind that um, almost twenty people have worked for him, and only one other has remained. That's a really high turnover rate. It means you have one out of twenty chances to stick around, not be fired, not be, uh, not quit or not, you know, whatever else. Um, so very low. I didn't know this. Um, I didn't realize this. This is not what I was told. <laughs> and then I realized this was the case. So, um, he complained that, well, but I, I paid to educate you. Total, it was 10 hours. I'm not saying it's nothing I'm saying I went really fast and I did the entire education in 10 hours so it's like 150 bucks it's not that big of a deal especially to a rich guy like that um so don't let him go on and on this belly aching um but uh yeah so, and then the last time I saw him, I, you know, I, I just kind of threw my hands in the air and gave up because after he, uh, assured me that my uncomfortability with lying, um, he wanted me to lie to Y Combinator about, um, about my job title, my position, that I had contracts, that I had equity that I didn't, shares in the company, um, responsibilities that I didn't represented more than I did. And I just was super uncomfortable with this. Um, so I said, no. And I said, I know this is going to threaten my job. And he said, no, it won't. And then turned around and fired me on the spot. Um, he knows that I'm, you know, obviously supporting a child by myself. He knows that I moved out here for this job. And yet the only thing that he said when I picked up, um, my last, um, it was actually, uh, my last little paycheck was, uh, I don't hate you. I'm just resentful right now. And I took this to be pure narcissism that you've just affected my livelihood. I'm displaced. I left all kinds of rent opportunity back in California. I had benefits in California. I didn't get benefits out here because I was working everything and all you want to talk about are your feelings how you're feeling so i left it at that if you have any messages or fake this or that know that it's not matching what i'm saying or doing that's all fake you guys that's all fake so no i am um you know <laughs> that relationship has been long done and it only lasted for about three, four weeks anyways, before it was just getting too, too weird for me not to say that it was weird. And, uh, that's, that's the status of it is long gone. So yeah, disregard their nonsense. They just do it to inflate their own egos.